Hey guys, this is Geek Out Everything, and we are back with another video, guys. And in this one, uh, we're gonna just little mess around with the Redmi Note 8 Pro. So yeah, in this video, I'm gonna show you uh, how you can uh, uh, just customize your Redmi Note 8 Pro like uh, I have done it because uh, you know the Mi Y the uh, I think it's a default launcher or default UI for Redmi Note 8 Pro or all the Xiaomi phones. It is not that great. In terms of features, it is actually really good. But when it comes to you know that uh, UI and some facial things, I don't think I don't think so. This is the best one. So as you can see, the icons are really big and they doesn't look that great. As you can see, they are just big, holy big man. And the text is also kind of big and if you see guys uh, it actually doesn't look that great like it's kind of a messy so in this one uh in this video i'm gonna show you how you can just change it like i've done it like nova launcher as you can see it is looking really nice like super clean and uh minimalistic kind of design and yeah in this video i'm gonna show you how you can do that for that you just have to download a nova launcher and uh, it would be much better if you just would upgrade it to the pro version because features like changing the icon size are only available in the pro version so it would be much better if you can do that but if not then there's no problem you can still customize your phone pretty nicely so when you go to the home screen settings icon layout you can change the icon size and the text also uh, which is really good you can change the uh, color of the text and all that stuff and you can also change the transitions like when you scroll around with the wallpaper and other stuff as you can see we have uh, these uh, transition effects which is really nice you can just customize according to your personal preference i would say so i think this is the best launcher uh, for uh, you if you want your phone to look like a stock android and if you want that stock android experience i think this is the best and we also have some gestures to mess around as you can see it's the swap up and all that stuff you can so you can map it uh, according to you you also have some uh, icon style and uh, some animation speeds so you can change that also and uh, if you want to change the icons you can also do that just download any icon you like from the play store and just change it from here that would be night in the night mode but uh, that doesn't so guys there are lots of options that you can use and as you can see I have uh, uh, done that and uh, I've just changed the icon size and some little settings so yeah and if you're wondering how I've changed that background that transparent background and as you can see we have this uh, background uh, color as you can see if you want white or if you just mess want to just change the background transparency then you can also do that and if you have noticed uh, in the original pixel launcher we do not have that uh, uh, black transparent uh, background in the app drawer we get that uh, um, I think white background so as you can see we also have this card background as you can see I've uh, just change it to the card option because uh, it looks like a card at the back the white card and you can also change the text of the icons so yeah that you can do that and guys to change the icon size you have to get the uh, premium version the pro version of the nova launcher because that option is only available in the pro version so yeah that's a little bit of uh, um, downside but uh, guys uh, if you can buy that and I think this is the best launcher and it will give you that stock Android feeling because this launcher helps you to just organize the stuff like organize your icons your text and all that stuff uh, because organized things always looks good guys as you can see and this is how you can do that and not only in the Redmi Note 8 Pro but in every device like in any device you can do that and guys trust me uh, whenever I get any kind of phone like Samsung phone or any other phone the first thing I do is install a Nova launcher because this launcher is so clean that it that it makes the experience really nice I would say and we also have a pixel launcher but uh, uh, due to some problems it uh, it's not working in my phone but guys uh, if you want to know about the pixel launcher let me in the comments below uh, maybe I'll get, give you the link of the pixel launcher because because the pixel launcher is also really good but it doesn't have that kind of uh, customization option so guys if you like this video hit the like button and if you haven't subscribed yet please hit the subscribe button peace out see you in the next one till then bye bye